All right, welcome back to Bible study. We're on question 13, and I'll be reading out of the ESV version of the Bible. And question 13 asks, Did our first parents continue in the estate wherein they were created? Answer, our first parents, being left to the freedom of their own will, fell from the estate wherein they were created by sinning against God. So here we see our first parents, which were Adam and Eve, and they were in the garden, and they sinned against God. So we'll read Genesis 3, verses 6 through 8, from the English Standard Version, the ESV. So when the woman saw that the tree was good for food, and that it was a delight to the eyes, and that the tree was to be desired to make one wise, she took of its fruit and ate, and she also gave some to her husband, who was with her, and he ate. Then the eyes of both were open, and they knew that they were naked, and they sewed fig leaves together and made themselves loincloths. And they heard the sound of the Lord God walking in the garden in the cool of the day. And the man and his wife hid themselves from the presence of the Lord God among the trees of the garden. Genesis 3, verse 13. Then the Lord God said to the woman, What is this that you have done? The woman said, The serpent deceived me, and I ate. And our next verse is in 2 Corinthians 11.3. But I am afraid that as the serpent deceived Eve by his cunning, your thoughts will be led astray from a sincere and pure devotion of Christ. So our parents lost their first estate wherein they were created without sin and, and holy unto God and, and able to please God with, because they weren't tainted by sin. So question 13, did our first parents continue in the estate wherein they were created? Answer, our first parents being left to the freedom of their own will fell from the estate wherein they were created by sinning against God. Thank you, and until next time, this has been Bible Study. Using the Westminster Shorter Catechism. God bless.